Hey guys, thanks for tuning into my video. In today's video, uh, I want to review a um, a Sig Sour. And let me just go ahead and show you it is empty. Take out the magazine. Rack the slide, you see it's empty. Nothing in it. Do it again. Okay. Um, like I say, this is the P220 Elite. Sig Sour, and this is in uh, the stainless steel, uh, pretty much polished, and has the uh, fancier type grips. Show you how that looks. And I have the stainless steel guide rod in there. I'll show you. And the barrel's polished also. Um, the Sig, Sour, uh, Sig Sauer P220 Elite is stainless steel and it is uh, all stainless steel. It's a very heavy gun. Uh, it is a uh, double action only, double single action, of course. You could cock it back once there, and here's the break on that. Look at you. Okay. Or you have a decocker which basically you bring it down like that you can let it go lightly or you can just have it down fast uh, like I say it is double action also so this is uh, pretty nice this one here I have a polished barrel in it it is an original sig barrel it has a beaver tail on it as you can see that grips are really nice it does have a lot of serration in there and it has uh, stainless steel there uh, what comes with it also is the 8 round magazine but you can't get a 10, a 10 round magazine for it um, the magazine release pretty much everything slide release takedown is all on one side but the magazine release here you can move it over to this side you you know pop a little there's a little hole there you pop that pin out this whole mechanism comes out take the grip off you'll be able to relocate that. It does have an external extractor, you see there, and it does have a firing pen in it. It's not strike or fire. It does come with night sights, however you can't see them too good there. Okay, I did polish them off. This is just a um, kind of a muzzle brake. It's a wolf, lone wolf, and I polished it out. Um, take it off, just use a little Allen wrench and I use this to protect the threads. I also have a thread protector for this too. It came with the barrel. I'll show you. I have a standard thread protector that I could put on that. Okay. Uh, take down of the gun is fairly easy. You cock it back and lock it. This is your take down lever. Push it down. Okay. Then just pull it back. Slowly go forward. Cock it, slide the barrel off. Uh, here's pretty much the inside of it. Uh, the recoil springs are color coded on one side. We take out the recoil rod with the spring, pop the barrel out. There's the buyer barrel, it's an original SIG barrel. You can see that it's all polished up and Pretty straightforward. Put it back in. Put it back in. Put the rear coil rod back in. A little slippy. Pretty much it. Uh, here is the bottom of the gun. You can see it's all metal thing in here. Um, like I say, and it is a standard firing pin in this. Putting it back together. We just line it up right there. Oh, my eyes will work for me. Line it up, slide it all the way. Okay, lock it back. Drop that. Just put that. Decock it. Back together. It's pretty nice. The uh, and I have the regular barrel for this too. I just I don't have the it in it right now. I have it. Um, I, I keep this barrel on it in case I want to shoot it with the suppressor. That's pretty much the SIG P220 Elite. 
It's a pretty nice gun. Um, uh, very reliable. Sig makes some really great products. And if you do want to get the uh, little, uh, you know, um, muzzle brake, you can get that too.